prior to your operation is a great time to try to make lifestyle changes that will help you to recover better after your operation and help you to lead a healthier lifestyle in the long run. Making healthy choices early on mean you'll have a more successful recovery after your operation. If you are active normally, keep up your normal routine. If you are well, get out and about. To help you improve your lifestyle and improve your health for your operation, you should think about things like stopping smoking. Your pharmacist or GP can give you advice on stopping smoking. This is important because smokers tend to have more secretions which can lead to chest infections and slow down your recovery. There are other healthy options such as cutting down on your alcohol consumption. Start eating more healthily and if you don't already, start to include walking into your daily routine. It's good to try to stay as healthy and fit as possible, but if you do feel unwell when you are waiting for your operation, the best person to see is your GP as they will know the most about your overall health. Your family or friends can help support you in any lifestyle changes, so include them in helping you. It is important to talk to family and friends before your operation to have a plan of who will help you at home and bring you into hospital and take you home as you won't be able to drive. You will receive a patient information booklet that will explain the journey and give you good advice to get healthy before and after your operation. Bring this with you when you come in for your operation to help guide your recovery. Before your operation, you should keep active while you are waiting, unless you have been specifically told not to exercise. Keep up your exercise you do normally, for example swimming, golfing or cycling. You might find that you have to take more frequent rests or cut down the length of time you do this activity. This is normal. Keeping active will aid your recovery. Walking is a great form of exercise and is something everybody can build up slowly. Start walking regularly, slowly building up your stamina. Remember to take rests when you need them and stop if you feel unwell. From our experience, we know that the fitter people are before surgery, usually the quicker the recovery is after. We will send you a letter with the date of your admission to the hospital and the date of your operation. When you are getting ready to come in for your operation, you only need to bring the essentials with you. Please bring good fitting shoes or slippers for walking with the physiotherapist a couple of pairs of pyjamas and a dressing gown and some toiletries. You don't need to pack any towels as they are available from the wards. Please bring all of your medication with you in its original packaging. Your family can bring more clothes when you need them.